hello all um, welcome to my channel now today in this section i am going to explain the step by step process of how to alc posting transfer to the main asset through distribution and the settlement process and later uh, later i will cover one more uh, one more i will do the one more session on alc posting transfer to main asset through internal order process so i will do another session on that so now here in this session uh, i will be covering the distribution and settlement process so before going to this i want to just brief about the what is aoc uh, so aoc is a asset under construction where some assets are in construction phase the cost needs to be captured for the time being and uh, once the asset is fully uh, fully completed then that cost would be transferred to the main asset so here in sap uh, we have uh, we have two process like a distribution and settlement and through internal order process so now i am going to cover through, uh, through distribution and settlement process so for that uh, for the for the first step it would be distribution and the second step would be the settlement so for the distribution we have to use the transaction code aiab so here I am going to enter the transaction code AIAB here and here my company code is 2000 and my AFA asset is 90101 and then click on execute here and here we can see we have two postings one is uh, 50,000 another one is 5 lakhs and select this line items and click on select click on enter here this one this button enter and here we need to select the account assignment category so i am selecting the account assignment category as a fixed asset and then settlement my settlement receiver would be 500008 and then here we need to mention the percentage how many per how much percentage do we need to transfer to this main asset so whether it is a uh, 10% 20% we can mention so in my case and for example i am taking as a 100% as an example and then just hit enter so here we can see the description of uh, the asset building office file and then click on once go and step back and click on save so earlier uh, it was showing in a uh, red status uh, error status now it's in green status now we can settle this this thing now i'm going to another section i'm opening another section okay now we have to use the transaction code eibu and i will come back from the screen and here just enter the asset uh, document data uh, now i have uh, access to the transaction code aibu now in this screen we will be doing the second step uh gpg the settlement so in the earlier screen we have uh, uh we have captured the distribution rule we have maintained the distribution rule so to against that we will be settling here so here uh, I have given my company code and asset number and document date and asset value date i'm giving the same dates and uh, initially i will show you the document type would be aa asset, asset. and here we can mention aoc okay aoc settlement domain asset and then here we have a test run and details list uh, initially i will execute this process in test run so click on execute here So here we can see the we don't have any errors now go one step back and uh, unselect the test run and then click on execute so here we can see the asset transaction was posted with the document number in company code 2000 with uh, 10083 in accounting principal local gap so this is the end-to-end -end process to to transfer the AFC asset cost to the main asset uh, with the help of uh, settlement and distribution process so in the later coming video i will cover the same process through with the with the help of internal order process uh, thank you so much for watching my videos thank you